Hi, this is Charlo for the Benelux Lightwave Resource website and for Liberty 3D. Um, this is a quick video on um, a um, free camera rig, uh, basically a lightwave scene created by Johann Stein. Uh, Johann Stein, it, I don't know exactly how to pronounce his, word, uh, his name exactly, he's from Scandinavia. Um, and he created this for the lightwave community and it's, it's free to use and it's actually pretty well thought of and it's uh, really handy and I'll show you what it does basically allows you to control the camera within your light wave scene as if it were on a rig like this <coughs> so you can uh, you can move it up and down left and right rotate it etc etc but the, the, the camera is always steady and, and uh, aiming at a certain point that you want um, you can download the file for free it's on the uh, Benelux light wave resource website it's under the um, scenes uh, category you can down also download it from uh, the guy itself, artstorm.net, artstorm.net. Um, so we'll jump into layout and I'll show you quickly what it does. So imagine you've created a complete um, a couple of objects and put them in the scene and now you want to animate it using camera rig. Um, you can just simply go into file and load and load up the camera rig and it will add it to your scene file. And you will en end up with something like that looks like this on the left side. Okay, so on the left side is the uh, perspective view, and on the right uh, side is the camera view. Um, basically, what it um, lets you do is, it, um, you want created a couple of nulls that allow you to cr um, to control the camera. So, if I click on hide, it allows me to move the camera up and down. See, if I click on rotate, then you press the Y key to actually rotate it, and it allows you to rotate the camera as well but it keeps the camera on the rig see and as you notice all also um, as you notice the camera keeps um, pointing to the front it's not turning not rotating together with the null right it's rotating the rig and the camera keeps looking in the same direction okay and we have the length and you can move the camera down the crane so to say the boom Okay, we've got a focus, and um, I'll show you a bit better by putting an object in there. Um, let's put salt shader. Uh, okay, that was the wrong one. I need this one. Visibility put it like that so we've got an object in there as you can see um, so again if you um, rotate it you see what ha what's happening right really neat and of course you can uh, move the uh, complete rig as well as if it were on a rail or anything like or anything like that or position it the way you want to Okay, you got a focus, which is really handy as well. So if I bring that back, you'll notice that the home logo there goes out of out of focus. And as soon as I move it in closely and put the focus focus on where the object is, it's perfectly in focus. See, and I'm doing that by in the camera view having the option motion blur and depth of field on. Okay, then it shows you that in um, OpenGL. You can use a target as well, so that the camera keeps looking at the target. And you can do th by that by uh, clicking on this little fella here, and it allows you to move that up completely, like a meter, from zero to one. And so it blends in how much the camera needs to look at the target. So if it's at a complete one, it's a, a completely on target. So and if you put move it to about half, you notice that it's half on target. Okay, so that's a neat feature as well. Um, then you have the uh, the use noise, and you can do that to um, fake camera shaking. And it's also from zero to one, and one being extremely shaky, as you can see. So now it's really shaky, and if I if I go through the timeline, you'll notice that it jumps up and down like crazy but of course you can just move that back a little bit like um, about two 
and then you notice a slight movement uh, for instance if there was an explosion or something like that all right so i'll put that back again um and that's basically what it does it allows you to control the focus the length the height rotate the whole thing um so that's a really really great camera rig for you to use and it's free you can just download it and use it right away um you can use it in basically anything that you're animating all right so this is a quick one there's also on the website a complete video of like 16 minutes done by Johan um explaining it in more detail and showing you how to load it up in a uh, complete scene that you've created and just load up the camera rig and and start using it okay so have a look at the uh, benelux lightwave research web website it's lightwave.designbro.nl and um thanks for watching